everyone. Welcome to Ubon Dasatani Candle Festival Document. I'm Mina Nitya Sud, number 17. I'm Shaki Nakun, number 1. We are the member of group number 1 of Matthew Four Slash 6. Today we will talk about Ubon Dasatani Candle Festival. Do you know the history of the Candle Festival? Let's know together! The history of the tradition of the candle festival came from in the past a long time ago. The monks had no electricity, so the villagers found a large candle to give the monks a bright spot. The monks will play to stay in the temple in the practice of doctrine of the Buddha or other daily routine. It starts at common Saturday to open Saturday about three months. To bring the candles to the villagers often arrange a pilot of palm. It was very funny and the next generation inherits it to become a tradition. The candle festival is a tradition that commemorates the commitment of the local community from the villager donate the candles to smell is in one candlestick. It experiences the unity of the group, requesting for wisdom the who has skill of technician, knowledge and expert in Thai pattern sculpture on the candle, coated with cotton skill and fresh flowers and made by our local craftsmen. The palace is decorated by using local products such as local costume. Dancing was added from the way of life of the villager in its a dance in the form of beautiful art. The music also uses the local instrument mixed with the playful chorus. It is a job that makes young people have the opportunity to get art and culture closely seen the volunteer. A hand to help other people in the temple, in the craft, the candle pattern, finding ways to make a splendid, beautiful but elegant entry to the palette we mix between the old and new generation, such as folk music. Lang or Bantu. There will be both the elderly and young people. Dancing will be used by younger children to adolescents rather than older people, expecting that local tradition will be inherited by the next generation. Today we have the special MCs. They are rational and emotional. They will talk about their candle making. Let's turn together with them. Yes, Mina and Shaki. I am rational for lab number two. I am emotional for lab number fifteen. Today we are at Mahavana Ram Paaram Luang Temple or Paiyai Temple. To talk about type of candle making. Type of candle making are two types. They are candle carving and molding. Candle carving design pattern to carve the body of the stem and top of the candles by use carving tools to make it into a three dimensional work creating or in the imagination. Big effect during carving. This may be mistake chuck at a small or larger shape and maybe some broken that need to fix. Candle molding. There are steps and methods similar to candle carving in every step. But there are two different candle molding use quality wax, which is cheap. But candle carving use good quality wax and more expensive, because if the quality wax is not good, when carving deep and complex in many steps, 
wax will be broken. Candle molding. It always smells to smaller than candle carving because of candle molding must be turned into shape and size smaller and then decorated with the thick flowers around it. Candle carving must be large for the space to carve on scrape off. Thank you, Rasha Noon and Tomon Chinook, to keep information for us about Thai of candle making. The next thing we have special MCs at Thung Si Mong Ubon Rajatani Province. Let's join together with them. Ubonlash Thani Kandan Festival concept in this year is to inherit belief in the city of Kandal. ซึ่งโชว์คอนเซ็ปต์ลําเดินดงออกการ์เต้นก้อนสีพันนอนสับกันมหาพนะ
องค์มหาเวสสันดรสร้างรถใจเหนือใสแดงประจำบุญสื่อทั้งท่านในทุนคำเมตตาลำถึงเราน้องเอามาเหล่าและเพียงยอมขอย่อมกันบาทคนสันเดียมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมีมี